Welcome to the second hour of this morning. Here are today's headlines. Korea is planning to start a travel bubble arrangement with Southeast Asian countries such as Singapore and Thailand as early as July for those who have been vaccinated. Airlines and the travel industry welcome the plan and are gearing up to prepare for increased demand with travel agencies offering pre-sale trips where travelers can pay first and travel later. President Moon Jae-in has accepted the invitation from UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson to attend the G7 summit from Friday to Sunday. This marks the second invitation extended to the president to the summit of the Group of Seven following the first invitation from the US last year. After discussing the Korean New Deal at the summit, the president will then make a state visit to Austria and Spain until Thursday. Kim Young-jun, a 29-year-old suspect who has recorded and distributed sexual videos of more than 1,300 men via video call over a period of seven-plus years, has been arrested and taken into police custody. Victims include 39 teenagers, seven of whom were allegedly lured to his home and motels to perform sexual acts. The Seoul Metropolitan Police Agency decided to disclose his identity in consideration of the severity of his charges and the likelihood of recidivism. His face will likely be disclosed to the public Friday morning during a transfer to the prosecution. Finally, U.S. President Joe Biden has revoked former President Donald Trump's ban on Chinese apps WeChat and TikTok and instead put in place an executive order to investigate apps controlled by foreign adversaries and determine whether or not they pose a security threat to the U.S. The new order also directs the Commerce Department to come up with recommendations to protect the data of U.S. consumers from foreign adversaries. And you can listen to these headlines once again on our YouTube channel by searching TBS EFM. Once there, you will also get a script of the headlines and subtitles as well. Coming up next, our weekly discussion segment, News Seminar.